one thing I know a marriage cannot last without love, trust and patience. So I hope the newly wed tonight will take home these three things. If you are able to do that, you are likely to have an everlasting married life. I'm so happy and honored to be here today in Nigeria to celebrate Aisha's special moment in life. Inshallah, she will have a blessed home and a blessed marriage. Huzaifa, you're so lucky to have um, Aisha as your wife, and I'm sure that you guys will live a happy life. I love you so much, Aisha. Huzaifa really is a gentleman, and I, when I say that, I mean it in the most traditional sense of the term. Marriage, they say, is a, a full of a lot of challenges. But seeing as you found each other, I'm sure there's no challenge that you two cannot overcome. So here is to hoping that this uh, lovely couple have a blissful, prosperous union, full of happiness, full of life, that will last to eternity. That's why I refer to her as my big sister. As I've earlier mentioned, Aisha and I have been friends for over a decade and through the years we've laughed a lot, cried a lot, and we've also had so many amazing memories together. She has always had my back and has seen the best in me, even at my worst, and encouraged me to be the better version of myself. I'm truly blessed to have found a sister and a friend in you, Aisha. And Huzaifa, you're one lucky man. You found yourself a treasure. A very rare gem. Aisha, I have no doubt that you'd make an amazing wife and even a better mother to our unborn children. Congratulations to you both. May your home be filled with so much love, laughter and happiness as you embark on this new adventure together. Aisha is our only daughter. Therefore, she's our princess. And uh, of course, with the wish of every parent to see this child get to the stage especially the girl child. Get educated, uh, get a husband, get married and settle down. It gladdens my heart to see my little daughter, even though there's a lot of pain seeing her go. But we know this is an institution created by Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. And that is an institution through which all of us who are brought into this world. So I wish her a very happy and successful married life. And I wish her, you know, a wonderful and great children and great family life. <laughs> 